What do you get when you multiply 6 by 9? 42, apparently. If you have no idea what I'm, what I'm on about, then you probably haven't read The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, or watched it, or listened to it. In, in this story, the answer to life, the universe, and everything is revealed to be 42 by the supercomputer Deep Thought. It's then revealed that Earth was constructed to solve the ultimate question so that the answer could be understood. The Earth is, however, destroyed five minutes before it can give the question. Though Arthur, a human who escaped the destruction, is still alive and well, and it is stated that the question exists in his mind. So it's extracted with a scrabble, scrabble board as, what do you get when you multiply 6 by 9? If you're still with me, then you're probably extremely confused. 6 by 9? That's 51! But is it? So today I'm just going to discuss how exactly 6 by 9 can equal to 42. The first thing you should understand is the concept of different counting bases. There's various of these. The main one that you're probably aware of is base 10, which was based off of our 10 fingers. So we count 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, then 11, 12, 13, and so on. The other base you might be aware of is base 2, this being commonly known as binary. Binary will go 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, and so on. So all that we need to do is find a base in which this calculation is valid. So when multiplying two things in one base will give one answer, and multiplying in another will probably give a completely different number. You see where I'm going with this? So all we need to do from here is find a base where 6 times 9 is 42. So let's try a few options. First, let's try base 16, also known as hexadecimal. It's the most common option behind binary in base 10. Its range goes from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, A, B, C, D, E, F, then 11, 12, and so on. So you may be thinking, why are there letters? This is so confusing. There are letters because there are obviously only 10 digits. So to make up for the ever-increasing demand of base 16, we use letters to substitute numbers beyond 9. So I'm just going to use a calculator because I'm kind of lazy. So we'll just put in 54 as the base 10 value, and we get 36. No, that's too low. So we need to go a bit below. Uh, base 15, no, that's, that's 39. Base 14, 3C, maybe base 13. 42, we have a match, people. But I wonder if this was intentional of Douglas on Douglas Adams' behalf. Was this meant to be a base 13 joke? Or was it just some random statement he chose to be a bit of a weirdo? Who really knows? I hope it's a joke, because this is brilliant. I love math humor. But anyway, that's probably not the true question, as it's later confirmed that the answer in Arthur's head is probably wrong as the native species, the ones that were supposed to be components of the computer, were wiped out and replaced with Arthur's ancestors, a bunch of bathing pansies who are their own story. But anywho, that's pretty much all I wanted to go over today. So, yeah, if you enjoyed this little video, please consider liking and maybe even subscribe. And if you didn't like it, feel free to leave some constructive criticism below. It's appreciated. Okay, yeah. Cheers.